What's up guys? This is I am. First of all, I would just like to apologize for my low voice because it's like 1:30 a.m. Uh, so everyone is asleep, of course. But getting onto the video, uh, today it was the day when uh, actually the jailbreak team released the untethered jailbreak for iOS 6.1. I also created a video tutorial if you wanna check that out. But what if if you are not the kind of the jailbreak person if you have already jailbroken and uh, if you want to get rid of cdia and uh, you know you don't want your jailbreak anymore it's very simple how to get rid of it as you can see i have a perfectly running all right cdia and uh, clean phone by the way so it's very simple how to get rid of it as you can see i am on ios 6.1 uh i'll just go to so if you can check that out ios 6.1 so now this tutorial is uh, will be cut into two parts so in the first part we are going to cover uh, the people who are not updated to the latest firmware that their device supports meaning i have an iphone 4s but i am on ios 6.1 which is the latest firmware that the device supports but what if i was on 6.0 or 6.0.1 or any lower firmware than 6.1 or for you guys any lower firmware that your i device supports it's very simple you need to update it to the latest firmware and that is just by hitting this button i have checked for update because i am on the latest firmware you guys if you are not on that you will have the update button only update now you just need to hit uh, the update button and it will start downloading the latest firmware in my case it if i was on a lower firmware it will start downloading 6.1 and once the firmware is downloaded uh, you can restore your iphone which i will show in the later part of the video and uh, you are done now what if uh, you guys are like me who are updated on the latest firmwares that their iphone supports it's very simple what you guys need to do is first of all you need to get your iphone into dfu mode it's very simple you just need to turn off your i device now I'll, I'll get to it in a minute and then you just need to hit, hit the restore button uh, hitting the restore button will download to 6.1 firmware or whatever the latest firmware that your i device supports and it will download the firmware so now let's turn off the device so after the device is turned off you need to hold the power button and the home button I mean power button and the home button together for 10 seconds 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 and release the power button and keep holding the home button until iTunes recognizes it. Alright, as you can see, it has given me a message. I'll place the phone here. And as you can see, it gives me a message. Oops itunes has detected an iphone in the recovery mode you must restore the iphone before it can be used so as i have already told you need to, you need to download those firmwares so now those firmwares are going to come handy you just need to shift yes on a pc shift or if you're on a mac option just restore and then you can directly download uh, the downloaded firmware just hit open restore So now as you can see our iPhone is completely new meaning it's like well, you know factory unlocked or something like that. So now I'll give my passwords and I'll be right back. So as you can see after giving all those passwords and stuff my phone is as clean and clear. No CDR, no slowing downs, no copyright, nothing. My iPhone is as clean as a factory unlocked iPhone. Now I just wanted to tell you guys that what if I, I did not have any data with Cydia but what if you guys have now it's very simple before doing all this process you can just back up to this computer as you can see I have right now in here just back up to this computer and you are done uh, once the backup is done while setting up your iPhone uh, you need to restore from your iPhone as you can see on this side 
we have this section that says uh, my iPhone now just click on that and here you can do this option which says restore from backup so you can do that and get all your applications all your photographs and all that stuff back so yeah that's it for the jailbreak video so if you like the video don't forget to hit the like button down there uh, yeah down there and of course i'm going to do a lot of those these kinds of videos so don't forget to hit the subscribe button down there so thanks guys for watching this video and of course don't forget to follow me on twitter and facebook because i update uh everything or before making a video i update all that stuff on twitter and facebook so yeah so thanks guys for watching this video and i will definitely see you in the next one namaste